Hello and welcome to the tutorial on Roman numerals. In this tutorial we are going to go through converting numbers from 40 to 50. So let's start with our first example. Suppose we have this number 43. How would we write this down in Roman numerals? Now as we've said before the first thing to do is to break this down into the tens and the units. First let's have a look at this. We've got four tens. So how do we write this down? We know this from previously. It is XL. Basically what we're writing down is 10 before 50. 10 before 50 is written as XL. So that is 40. And now we are going to do the units, which is 3. How do we write 3 down? Well, that's quite easy. It is just simply 1, 2, 3. And that is how we write down 43. First of all, write down 40 that is XL and then write down the 3 I I I 43 in Roman numerals is XL I I I let's have a look at our second example suppose this time we have number 49 now I want you to do this one what you do first well first, as before, we look at the tens. How many are there? There are four. So we have to write down 40. How do we write 40? It is X L. That is 40. And the XL is the same as above. 10 before 50. Now how about the units? How many units are there? There are nine. How do we write 9 down? Well, you know this. It is 1 before 10. So 1 before 10 is IX. And that is the 9. So 49 is written as XL. That's the 40. And the 9 is written as IX. So 49 in Roman numerals X in Roman numerals is XL I X again it's very very simple as long as you break it down into tens and units it's very simple now let's suppose we've got a Roman numeral and we want to write it in numbers so let's have a look at an example suppose we have this number here we've got X L V I XL VI. Now, how are we going to break this down? What number do you think it represents? Shout out the answer and then we'll work through it. Have you made a guess? Great. Okay, so let's go through this. Now, it starts with an X, so we're going to carry on this across until we get to an I or a V. So that is the tens. How many tens are there? It's XL. This is 10 before the 50. 10 before 50 is 40. So that is the tens component, 40. Now how about the units? That is the VI we have here. The V is 5 and the 1. So that is 6. Therefore, XL VI is 46. Basically, you're adding those two together. It's 40 and 6, which makes 46. XL VI is 46. Okay, now let's look at another one. Suppose now we have XL. V 
I, I, I. So it's a bit longer, this one. X, L, V, I, I, I. Again, if you know it, shout out the answer. Okay. Right. We're going to work through this then. So we start with the X. X, L. We've come to a V, so therefore we have to stop there. What is XL? It's the same as this. 10 before 50, so therefore that is 40. And how about the units? What well, is 5 plus the 1, 1, 1, which is 5, 6, 7, 8. So it's 40 and 8. So therefore, XL V. I, I, I is 48. XL, V, I, I, I is 48. And that is how we convert Roman numerals into numbers and vice versa. Always break it down into the tens and the units. That makes it much simpler to work it out.